me out, it's Rowy here. It's um, Sunday night, which means it's the end of my working week, so I'm here, I'm all alone in the brewery. And um, it means it's time to have myself a little beer. I reckon a celebratory beer to celebrate the end of the working week as opposed to my normal beer at the end of every shift, which is to celebrate surviving the, the day again. But um, as I posted about earlier on on Instagram and um, Facebook, I am going to try and get more Nottingham beers um, on, involved in the channel, at least one a week. And we're going to kick off today, seeing as how it's Stout Sunday, with, um, from Totally Brewed. This can has been dropped about 15 times, but um, it, it'll still be re. Uh, this is Grand Papa Jangles Biscoffy Stout, which means it's a stout with uh, Biscoffin, presumably. Um, now, Totally Brewed, for those of you who, um, who don't know, is... Uh, well, one of the owners is a Mr. Robert Witt. And so, uh, now Mr. Robert Witt, for those of you who don't know, um, is up there. He's almost as important as me in the world of Donk beer memes. Um, he does make some of the freshest memes about beer on the planet. Not, they're not quite rowies, they're not quite rowies, but they're still, they're still good memes. And uh, do you know what else he makes? Bloody good beer. That's what he bloody does. Mm -hmm. So, totally brewed. Grandpapa Jangles. This is a Biscoffee Stout at 7%. Um, yeah, let's get this bloody open, shall we? Let's get it opened and get it bloody slurped. So it's been out of the uh, it's been out of the fridge for hours, to be honest with you. But it has been at the in the beer cellar at Neon. So it's been at around 4 degrees, which is fridge temperature. But it's been out for about 20, 30 minutes now. So yeah, let's get it poured. Well, there we go. Ding dong. Biscoffs are great, aren't they? They're them little. Um, biscuits you get with coffee in uh, in posh places and some people buy it in spreads and put it in cheesecakes and that which is uh, which is ridiculous because if you're an adult and you eat dessert um, something's obviously gone wrong with your life because although to be fair uh, a um, a treacle tart with some Cornish clotted cream is delicious but apart from that or maybe a lemon tart lemon tarts are great as well and apple pies are pretty good and Apple crumbles, but desserts are peng, which you know that I think about it, desserts are really, really good. And so, let's hope this beer gives me my just desserts. And uh, it's great, so look at the colour on that, there we go. It's a dark beer, that's what I was expecting it to look like. Let's have a little, uh, little sniff. You can smell, there's a lot of toasted malts, a hell of a lot of uh, roasted malts on that one. Very malty, very malty, oh yeah. Enough of this nonsense, it's Sunday night. Let's get it slurped. Mm, delicious. It's absolutely delicious. You definitely get um, the Biscoffee. Is definitely the Biscoffee. I can say they're not going to sue me. The Biscoffee is definitely there on the right at the very finish. It's just a really well made, well made 7% stout. No messing around with that. If um, it's it's definitely there it's there but it's almost like a, a blink and you'll miss it type thing but uh it, it's no that's no bad thing in the grand scheme of things it's just a fantastic really well made uh, delicious easy drinking uh, easy drinking stout so as always hats off to um totally brewed for not getting out of the park again with another delicious beer so yeah thank you very much for watching uh if you have enjoyed the video which i would understand if you haven't if you have enjoyed the video um as always give me a little like and subscribe it always uh, goes a long way thank you so much indeed uh, have yourself a lovely uh lovely rest of your night yeah see you in a bit yeah, 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 yeah.